the truth of the matter is we have old infrastructure. We have a national grid that is more than 50 years old. We have a national grid whose transmission lines are weak. The towers are falling. And the substations, the transformers are old. In fact, the transformer that actually exploded in Deba was 47 years old. We've been trying to revamp this, to change them, but they cannot all be changed overnight. So it's like you're having a rickety car. You'll be expecting breakdown once in a while. What we continue to do is continue to manage the grid to prevent frequent occurrence of the grid disturbance until we're able to completely overhaul the grid itself. Then we'll have reliable grid. Secondly, we are working on establishing what is called a super grid, which is a backup or failover optional grid. If the national grid has a problem, there will be an alternative route through which power can be transmitted. That is what we are working on. Then lastly is the fact that the world has moved beyond having a centralized grid. Grid must be regionalized. We must have state grids so that each of the regionalized grids will be insulated from each other. A problem in a particular line will not affect the others. That is what we are working on. Until that is done, we believe that we'll keep managing what we have and reduce the frequent occurrence of the grid disturbance. Oh,